guys. Catalina Island, who would have thought? Good job, babe. Look how cute this place is. We'll show you more videos and pictures later, but first we gotta eat something because we're starving. I need a taco, a taco, taco, taco. <laughs> my first spiel of my very first vlog and I'm vlogging just to share my day-to-day -day. Um, maybe none of you care so that's fine press that pause button and exit out of that browser no um, I also have a bad memory so I'm hoping that it'll be really cool to reflect and my camera's dropping hold on I'm terrible this is going off really well um, <clears throat> Okay, um, I feel like I like to connect with people and it's falling again. Hey, <laughs> somebody out. Yeah. All right, video is the new thing and vlogging is fun, I feel like. Uh, I'll get to connect with people hopefully on a more personal level. Um, I think that's really important. So, um, you know, we all go through certain things on a day-to-day -day basis and I'm gonna just document mine so that you can all see what I go through in real estate and with life, um, with my boyfriend and my dogs. Um, yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoy it and I hope that we can make a connection and if not, that's fine too. Then I'll have some memories for myself. Me, myself, and I. I have one subscriber on YouTube. Let's get that up. We're gonna go shoot some 18 holes of gold. I could really use a change of scenery. Yeah. Everybody smoking all the greenery. Yeah. Close the match cause they were handed down to me. But I'm still fly. I'm still fly. I know. I'm still fly. I'm still fly. Let's go. I have to write two offers for one of my investors that are due tomorrow. And, um, I'm starving, haven't eaten anything today, worked out this morning, and also supposed to do this midway spiel for my first vlog. And I really want to, it's super fun, I'm liking this, but I just am running out of time, so this is what you guys get, <laughs> the real stuff. Today, I'm dealing with an appraisal that came in low, uh, $24,000 low to be exact, um, which the appraiser was very conservative, and you know, maybe, it's worth maybe $10,000 more. So we've submitted a rebuttal on a rush. The lender is great uh, and it's been amazing in helping me do that. But this agent is a little bit more experienced than I am in, in her mind, she is. She doesn't know I have things in my back pocket. Um, but I've been super nice. Like my whole way of doing business is I'm gonna be very nice to you and kind and respectful until I don't have to. And so all weekend we've been negotiating back and forth. They've been very, very kind. And now she is pushing me. She's emailing me like nonstop, texting me nonstop, not because contingencies are due, not because we have a notice to perform, but just to try to bully me. Like she's saying all of these things, um, trying to take advantage of me being a newer agent and it's not working and I'm gonna get mad soon. And I'm gonna defend my clients and I'm going to do what's right by them. So just a quick lesson to agents that bully. One, that's not nice. Didn't your mom teach you not to bully? But two, just don't take advantage of people. Like it's just rude. That's not how I carry myself. It's not how I run my business. Uh, don't bring out the nasty. It's coming. It's coming in. <laughs> business and I'm a little emotional I'm kind of heartbroken 
but I'll explain that in another video. I just wanted to thank you guys for all watching this and um, episode one of my vlog is a success. I hope it was entertaining. I promise to continue to make it entertaining and interesting and I hope that you learn things, real estate tips, lifestyle tips, um, things to pay attention to in regards to being a buyer, um, things to avoid in regards to being a buyer, um, seller tips will follow later on and um, yeah, so I look forward to continuing to share my journey with everyone and I'm excited about that and I hope that I get two subscribers now, maybe, <laughs> or maybe not, we'll see. Um, but I promise to keep it interesting and exciting and upbeat and happy and fun and positive. Um, there are days like today where I look like this and um, it wasn't the best day but um, everything happens for a reason. I'm a firm believer in that and um, it'll all work out how it's supposed to. So uh, you win some, you lose some. Any other sayings that I can mention? Um, I don't think so. But cheers you guys. I'm gonna have a glass of wine and cuddle up on the couch, watch 90 Day Fiance with my man and my doggies. Peace.